Some applications and games are designed to use specific ports, but all routers come with a basic firewall that may block those ports. So, to make the game or application work properly, you have to open the specific ports in your Wi-Fi router. When you open a port in your router and choose a device on the network to forward specific traffic to is called port forwarding. In this video, I'll show you to set up port forwarding in TP-Link router. First of all, log into the TP-Link router's web interface. You need to assign a static IP address to the computer for which you are opening the port. To do so, go to the DHCP section on the left panel. Click on DHCP client list. Note down the MAC address and IP address of the computer. Then click on address reservation. We'll tie the IP address with the MAC address so that the router always uses the same IP for the computer. So we have reserved a static IP for the computer. Now it's time to configure the port forwarding settings. On the left panel, you should see an option called forwarding or NAT forwarding. Click on it. Click on add new. Here you'll type the port number or port range that you want to open. If you don't know what numbers to type here, portforward.com has a list of common ports for all popular games and applications. For example, I want to port forward a Minecraft server. So I'll go to the list that starts with M. Then press Ctrl plus F on the keyboard and search for the application name. Here it shows the default TCP and UDP ports for a Minecraft server. I'll copy the port number from here and paste it into the server port. Then enter the IP address of the computer. The service port and internet port are usually the same, so you can keep it empty. Then specify the protocol used for the application. Finally, select the enabled option and click on save. After you have created the rule for the TCP protocol, make a new one just for the UDP ports. Port forwarding is now configured for your computer. Once you have set up port forwarding, you can use this website to scan your network for open ports. I'll provide the link in the video description. It automatically detects your public IP. Just enter the port and click check. As you can see, the port is still blocked on my network. Guys. If the port forwarding didn't work, please check if your WAN IP and the public IP are the same. If your WAN IP is private and it's different than your public IP, that means there are other NAT devices connected in between your router and the internet. You can also trace it using a simple command. Open CMD, type traceRT, then your public IP address, hit enter. If it detects more IP addresses other than your router's IP, your network is behind other NAT devices. So in this case, port forwarding is not going to work if you only open ports in your router. However, you can contact your ISP and ask them to unblock the ports and see if they can do anything for you. 